The other day, I came across uh, this treat. I'm at my wit's end, like they're actively trying to dox everything, hacking into one of my accounts and they are posting CP on it. They are trying to get my phone number and they are trying to involve my other family members. Please, anyone, I beg you help. So, I saw this. I, 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 bro, I saw this and so I tried looking a little bit deeper into it. There are two videos that he made in this regards, which explain the situation better. We are going to watch both of them. One from two days ago and one from one day ago. We're going to watch both of them. But first, we're gonna look through the account a tiny bit. So, from what I saw, this is where it started. Well, basically down here. Basically down here is where it started. How do you think Twitter will react to this being animated? This and another tweet. I blurred it out. Apparently this is an anime called Dan Da Dan. I think it's being aired right now. And uh, these are two, I don't know, high schoolers, middle schoolers, basically just in their underwear, be naked and all wet on top of each other. I don't know. I don't, I don't know what this is about, man. I really don't know, but and here's another one. The animation didn't need so, to go this hard for this scene. From what I understood from the comments, this is also da da done. And this is basically a um, R slash scene. This guy has a robotic dick. This guy down here has got a robotic dick. I blurred this for a reason. She's not completely naked. She's not completely naked in the post, but yeah, so he posted this and that and done. Yeah, something like that. What is this anime? I don't know. I haven't watched this anime, but apparently people say it's good. I don't know. Gotta look into it. Da da done. Yeah, it's something. I think done da done or something. It's a shonen sci-fi action anime. In all honesty, I don't mind when anime go dark. I don't mind when anime go dark. I actually applaud animes when they go dark and show fucking shit that other anime don't dare to show. That is done? Yes, that is done. I think it's pretty good when anime can turn darker, you know? But... How do you think Twitter will react to this being animated? As well as this post being made. This was on the 3rd. This one was on the 5th. This, this one is the one right here. I am not scrolling further down here because, uh, yeah, not very TOS. It gives more life? Yeah, it's because shit like this happens IRL, of course. IRL, people don't actually have a fucking robot dick. I hope not. But shit like this happens, it's as unfortunate as it is. Shit like this does happen. Dark thing is being shown in art are important. Yes, yes. Speak for yourself? Yeah, I'm speaking for myself. What? what uh, I am. What about it? I am speaking for myself. This is my stream. I am very much speaking for myself. Yes. Why, thank you. On <laughs> the Robodong pod? Okay, fair enough. Fair enough. Fair enough. <laughs> Either way. Meanwhile, my DMs and quotes riddled with this over an anime post. You generally think this is a normal response for a thousand times to wish death on me, but I'm annoying for calling people like this out. Please, for once, push aside pretty hatred and have some humanity. I don't think I'm mentally prepared to see Shibi treat about the series every week from now on. He's gonna do nothing but bring negativity to it. So, Chibi Reviews is posting about Dun 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 uh, with the darker scenes in it. As you can see here, those darker scenes. But, if I ever saw you in real life, I would stomp the brainstem out you and spit on the chanking shake King Corpse. I... I'm gonna say it, I don't think posting this is that bad. I don't think this post right here is that bad, because how do you think Twitter will react to this being animated? I think that's okay to post. <laughs> because Twitter is going nuts over this post already. You can already see Twitter's reaction here. I've seen worse, to be honest. Yeah, I've seen worse too. Bro, if you're not ready for dark themes, you know? And... This doesn't mean that he enjoys CP, by the way, which people are saying. Which, I have no idea who Shibi Reviews really is. I just came across his post as it's making us round now. Twitter panic? Yeah, Twitter panic. 
So I really don't know much about him. Some people say he is into lollicon shit. Some people say he is into CP. I don't know. So that's why we're looking into it. Gushing over magical girls? I, I don't like this anime really much. Mm. The hypocrisy is why they accuse you of appreciating an SA scene, but then turn around and send death threats. Cheapy, evil, random X user, good, because sending death threats over a fictional show is totally fine, right? That's what I'm on about. Sending death threats to anyone is not okay. Kids in underpants are just a funny trip of media. That's true. That is true. The way it's depicted there... Uh, as someone who's seen Berserk and Higurashi, I've seen worse. Yeah, I've seen the entirety of Higurashi too, bro. Igurashi is so messed up. I'm gonna be honest, gushing over magical girls was bad, but it was hilarious. I I didn't even want to get into it, bro. Like I didn't even want to watch uh, watch a gushing over magical girls because, yeah, yeah, I didn't even want to get into that shit, man. Either way, the normal people, everyone. I'm going to continue posting whatever the hell I want. Having thousands of seething over me breathing gives me unimaginable joy. We need to bring back killing annoying people. Hey, let's bring that back. Please, God, smite this man so he can finally get off my timeline. Block him. <laughs> There's a block feature, you know? Block him. Or, you know what else you can do? You can click here and click... Uh, okay, you can't do it right here. Give me a moment. I'll show you what else you can go do. Home, timeline. If the timeline would load. Thanks. You can click here. Not interested in this post. Whoa, mind blown. What? You can do that? No way. Wallah belahi. You are the most disgusting creature I have laid my eyes upon. You are the mistake of Yakub and he sh you Ooh, shop spent eternity in hell for even for it. Even Dajai won't accept you. You are humanity's worst traits person fight. You have pedal pre comp for brains, you well fuck. What in the Habibi? Yes, what in the fucking Habibi, man? This? <laughs> wallahi, wallahi! Wallahi, wallahi! <laughs> oh, Twitter! Twitter, Twitter, Twitter! We need to stone this guy. Okay. Correct me if I'm wrong, but he's not glorifying anything here. Like, he's not glorifying this at all. Like, uh, my brother in Christ, am I stupid or is he not glorifying this scene? Like, yes, I censored it because TOS, right? I censored the shit because TOS. She's in her underwear. He's naked. But you can't even see genitalia. You cannot even see the genitalia in this image yet. You cannot. They're just... Quote unquote naked. It's not even not safe for work. It's not even a not safe for work environment. So surrender shit then you, uh, says you're disgusting. Yeah. So him asking how Twitter will react to this. Th that's a pretty Twitter up quote. Passing the picture together, it is a standard scene for matchy animes. Yeah, kind of, right? Just the edgy fucking garbage. You'll never believe why they said this to me. I wonder how this his mother will react when I blow his head up like Homelander. Very normal Twitter response in my opinion. Yeah, very, very. Mm -mm. <laughs> I wonder. He's just pointing it out. What's he saying carries a negative expectation, but he is not directly giving his opinion. Yeah! Yeah, 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 that's what I mean. He's not giving his opinion on it. He's not giving his opinion on this at all. Uh, so this is gushing over. This is bleach. Mask off for a moment. Do I rage back intentionally? Honestly, I don't really try to at all. This is definitely rage baiting though. This is rage baiting. People will say, but you make posts about gatekeeping or talking about controversy. At first, it's an innocent post only meant to talk about what moments in a series. But when I do get people upset and they flood my notifications, of course I'm gonna farm engagement. There it is. There it is. Farm the haters. Why wouldn't I turn a bad situation into money? True! <laughs> True! People are like, you're pity farming, so what? So you're saying I shouldn't expose death threats against me? I should shut my mouth and be silent? When I see a post reach 12k likes over wishing me to die, you expect me to stay quiet? If this was me two years ago, not gonna lie, I'd be extremely depressed thanks to everything these, uh, these last few days. However, one day I stopped caring and posted whatever I wanted. 
Which is why I post edgy posts often. There it is, it's edgy. Cause I no longer care if people want to slander me. If people want to treat fictional characters better than a living and breathing person, then so be it then. Get mad, get frustrated with me over my posts. I won't stop and if you are truly upset with me, there's a handy feature on the site called the mute or block button. What? You can mute and block people? Anyway, sorry for the long post. Love y'all. Honestly, based opinion. From the haters. From the fucking haters. Burn to fans and others trying to dox me now. But... Oh, I'm evil for an anime post. Also, this is public information I talked about in my vlogs years ago. So, yeah. Fucking Boruto to fan posting his fucking shit out there, but he says this was already out there, so it doesn't matter to him. Was always thinking of getting a Twitter troll account, but I would put much time and effort in it. Eh, do whatever, honestly. If you wanna farm the haters, go on. Don't do it for free, though. His name is with Penguin Zero? Where does he live? I don't fucking know. Tampa FL, Florida? Okay. And someone officially doxed my real information. Also, they mocked my dead brother that committed suicide. You know who you are, and I'm going to speak to my lawyer now. Yeah. Yay, let's dox people. Woo, doxing. Woo, good job, Twitter. Good job, good job. It's it's never okay to dox anyone, man. No, I want to I wanna retract that statement. Sometimes, sometimes it is necessary when people do vile shit, right? But... This guy, who is he harming? He's just rage baiting on Twitter. He's just fucking rage baiting on Twitter. I need to turn on the music for myself a bit and for you guys. We did it, Patrick. We saved Twitter. Yeah! Those that used me for cloud that helped get all my personal info doxxed. You know who you are. You ain't good people. I got screenshots and will be using them as evidence. You wanna actually bring me harm? Be ready and face the consequences in court. FYI, they leaked actual pictures of my house and brother's grave. So I don't feel safe right now. Oh, Jesus fucking Christ, man. Doxing if done for a reason like child essay should be done. Yes, yes, that's why I retracted my statement. But done directly to law enforcement, not public. Yes. Yes, 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 absolutely. That's why I retracted it, right? Because there are reasons when doxing can be helpful. For example, child essay or overall essay, like when there's an actual vile person, person behind. Follow up. I've now made a police report and going through the legal procedures. I'll be making a video as paper trail, but that will be the end of this one now. Cause for legal reasons. We're gonna watch those two videos in a moment. My official response to my personal information being doxxed, having this time stamped and dated for evidence alongside my police report. I will be opening up a lawsuit for doxing of my private information and defamination from the same individuals. I got doxxed! Yay! Switching gears, I'm now gonna go back to regular posts. We're talking about anime. Open Twitter, first thing I see is a post with 16k likes. Happy my brother is dead. You all are truly vile beings. You hate me so much that you'll justify it's okay to slander my deceased brother. This is ridiculous, man. Like, bro, this is actually vile. Like, I don't have any other words for this than other than being vile. Like, why do you feel the need to bring in family members that have absolutely nothing to do with it? Over rage bait. Over fucking rage bait. Remember everyone, I'm the evil one. Always make sure to say Shibi reviews is a weirdo that needs to stop existing. Sending Chibi reviews threats, doxing him and slandering his dead brothers justified because he posted a dun 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 daran tweet. You all that contributed to this in the last few days. One day I hope karma gets you. Fuck your lollicon fans and dead brother. Yeah, I'm not gonna say that. Um, FYI, they leaked extra pictures. Yeah, yeah, makes sense. Absolute normal human behavior. Normal human behavior. Now that the dox post was removed, proof members of the Boruto community doxed me. Here's the individual that did it. With his old account and you can easily find how he interacts with Kree, a known Boruto fan that slandered me almost two years ago. Because clearly they can't find dirt on him, so they resort to ad hominem attacks, yeah? I feel like people have grown more comfortable with expressing violent desires. I swear the internet wasn't the same for 10-15 years ago. I agree. Like, I agree with this. It really does feel like it. 
We smoking on your brothers too. Also, I'm at go use the dragon balls to resurrect your half brother. That and needs to needs that shit. Disgusting, disgusting and vile behavior. A lot of shit happened, but she be just blaming Boruto fans, so everything is just funny, lol. Cause I'm the, cause I'm the who leaked to him, lol, and I'm a Boruto fan. This dude is capping. You do not need to care about him. He is a Naruto fan. I'm a Boruto fan. I tweet about Boruto regularly. We still smoking on Eddie. I assume that's his brother. Disgusting. That's because they feel safe wearing a mask. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, and I've gotten hate for this too, but I said, I said before that s some things on the internet need to be able to be held responsible. Like some things at least, you know? You shouldn't just be able to go fucking rogue on the internet. I don't even know what to do anymore. I have people literally hacking my accounts, trying to find my SSN and so much other stuff. Guys, I seriously need help. We're making the post without the link. Someone hacked into my old DeviantArt account from 10 years ago. They are now posting actual CP on there. Please report this account. They are currently trying to get into more st of stuff. So! So! Guys! Uh, the people are saying, Yo, this guy is a PDF! Hacks into their account. Posts CP. Make it make sense. Make it make sense! They're... It does not make sense. It does not make sense. Like, are you for real? Are you for fucking real? And I have no idea if this guy actually is a lollicon or not a lollicon, right? I actually have no fucking idea. I couldn't care less at the moment. I, I could not care less at the moment because people are actually posting CP on an account on a DeviantArt account that is publicly available. Oh my god. And mostly, all over fucking opinion, mostly this is about those two posts. This is about those two posts right here. Mainly, he's not, he's just not bothered by it. There you go. Do people really want me to just end it all that badly over an anime post? You all seriously want to push me that? Push me to that, bro. This, this sounds so bad. I'm at my wit's end. Like, they're actively trying to dox everything. Hacking into one of my accounts and they are posting CP on it. They are trying to get my br phone number and they are trying to involve my other family members. Please, anyone, I beg you, help me. So this is the post we've seen here. This is goddamn awful. Exobot got back to me and unlocked my account after they became aware of everything. It has been locked for 24 hours. I'm not gonna post much here for a while. Maybe we shall see. How I am not moving... I'm moving forward and focusing on what I love. Anime, manga and the discussions around the series I love. To those that supported me, thank you from my, the bottom of my heart. I'm not really gonna check my DMs or notifications right now. I'm going full dark and muting everything. Gonna focus on my family, my GF and playing Sparky and Zero that just released. Love you all. Chibi out. This is horrible. Uh, okay, you're saying that it's... Um, fuck. Gerechtfertigt. Um, brain can translate right now either. It's a justified critique on the um, manga. I don't even care about lolicons. I mean, it's just a drawing pixel picture. Yeah, it has its stigmas. But if people don't commit any actual crimes, then I don't care. Uh, which hunts are also against Twitter tiers, aren't they? I think so. I think so. Let's watch the videos. I now have enough evidence to really press criminal charges and get like Homeland Security, cyber security and stuff and even the FBI involved. I've talked with a few people that have pretty much told me the same. And um, with the evidence now that I have, definitely something potentially can be done. But on with, the other hand... From what we've seen, yeah, 100%. He really does need to get um, uh, the justice system, police involved. It's don't crazy think he is to a me PDF. I don't think so either. Started. Based not from what I've seen so far. An image or not an image, a little scene of Dawn to Dawn. Just, I guess if we want to really end this up one. an edgy post. Oh, uh, this one I guess. Not even real fiction. And I guess originally this one it's and not then just this personal one. insults to me, death threats to me. But makes sense. It's also where my obviously my brother's <laughs> grave. This, this is so fucking disrespectful, man. 
Oh my god, from what I've seen of his work, he's not. He really doesn't care about any lolly related thing and really doesn't bring it up. He mostly watches action, anime, fantasy, and some horror thriller shows. ReZero is one of his favorite shows. I love ReZero too, man. Has been docked mm. to the point to where so in that case, people have the GPS coordinates. Like, the actual coordinates to where it's Ridiculous! At. I have the person responsible for doxing, which I... What is blurred? Okay, so I explained this image at the start, but here, this is a video scene. This guy got a robocock. This right guy got a robo chicken. This guy got a robo chicken, and here's a woman. Here's a woman that he's doing um, non consensual shit. Schoolers slash middle schoolers, it's an edgy scene. Girls in underwear. Guy is uh, naked, I don't know how they ended on top of each other, and he just made a post, how do you think Twitter will react to this animated? Because this is getting animated! The show is airing at the moment! Thankfully, have an image here I could just show you guys. It's a struggle snuggle, censored. yeah. But the person responsible here, you know, is actively now messaging people to, um, more or less, come kill me. DMing them my address. People saying that it wasn't the Boruto fandom. He, regardless if this is a setup or not for the Boruto fandom. Bro, the Boruto fandom is one of the vilest fandoms out there for some reason, and I don't understand why. What is it with the Boruto fandom being so fucking toxic? I don't get it. MHA? Yes, MHA, but it's on a different scale. It's on a different scale. The Boruto fandom is just purely fucking toxic. Just Boruto. He's a mm. part of the Boruto community. <clears throat> the straight up. That, that's what this individual is. He admits it himself. And on top of that, having contact with Kree, which was the person responsible for about a year and a half, two years ago, get, causing the slander to call me a pedo. And that has gravitated to this degree, to where I'm currently at. It is in that. It is yep. insane how insane. we got here. It's insane that my family is being doxxed. Ridiculous, my in fact. Is in danger. I have to call law enforcement to be able to guard my place. I have to. I have to worry about my social security number being hacked into. They were actively. I have the receipts, the messages, and Over everything of it. Over a Twitter IDs. post. People over a Twitter post, post of an edgy show. This is a really edgy, not edgy with a double C, edgy, D-H-Y, E-D-H-Y. Edgy as hell show, a show that's showing darker themes, it seems. Over shit like that, he's getting dogs. The animation didn't need to go that hard for this scene. He's fucking rage baiting Twitter, man. Bro, it's insane. Actively trying to get my social security number people trying to actively get my phone number and then i have people on twitter here and even people in my comments on my youtube video saying and deflecting like oh why'd you mention the boruto community because it's members <laughs> but, uh, because they're proud that they're members of the boruto community that's boruto why community. okay what what else would you want me to say okay I i'm not playing it safe here my life is not just in danger it's my girlfriend's life my dog's life, my cat's life, and my family as well. Now it's gone too far. Like, <laughs> I'm sorry, but bringing pets into the situation, that's too far. Bro, p pets? No. Leave the dogs and the cats alone, man. Bruh. Never argue with a bird to fan, they will dox you. Bro, it's insane! Well, at this point, and my brother's grave site is in jeopardy. How I'm the hell? How the hell did they get access to that information, God. man? Just how vile and evil people can be. I don't care. Doxing over this is disgusting. It you is. Can call me a gooner. Hell, call me a pedo, okay? I don't I don't care, okay? Because I know it's not true. Call me that. I don't care. Based! Based! That That sentence right, right there, based. I will be quite honest on this matter. Telling someone to end themselves, although a bit extreme, should not be banned. But explicitly calling for someone to be ended or saying you'll end them yourself should be taken seriously. Yeah! Yeah, 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 yeah. No, no, I agree. Like, end yourself? 
you know, that's that phrase has been around forever at this point. People in League of Legends use it daily, multiple times a game. You know? It's like personally, I've I'm desensitized to that. <laughs> personally, I'm desensitized to that to that um kiss in Danish a sentence, you know? But calling for someone to be heard specifically and Putting their information out there. Now it's an actual death threat. But when you attack someone's family and deceased family at that. It's disgusting. You're no longer in my personal eyes even human anymore. How can you even be Ooh. viewed upon as a human when you could do something just so despicable? I know these people get brownie points and me even posting this video is going to make them happy. But receipts are made now. I got the receipts. Enough evidence. And I'll tell you what. Mm -hmm. I will 100% doing everything I can. Honestly, good good for him that he's going to uh, police with that. Say it, but uh, to always put in-game after it to make it less heavy. Yeah, 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 yeah. Always gotta put the in-game. Being an asshole is fine even if in poor taste. Yeah, yeah. This is next level gross. And I just cannot believe what I have witnessed from content creators as well on this platform that have actively justified everything that's happened to me because they don't like me, because I'm annoying, because I'm weird. Damn. I have massive content creators that legitimately have justified things. What? Do you guys know who? Like, do you guys have any idea who? Like, I don't know anyone. Like, I didn't even know the guy until I saw the initial tweet. That's gross, man. Oh, That's I could buy what element. We live in a society now that it's fine to dox someone. We live in a society, for fuck's sake. <laughs> oh, I'm so brain rotted. We live in a society! <laughs> Bringing in his family is this issue. It's such a pussy move. Like, you got problem with him, settle with him. Leave the others alone. And this is over a fucking Twitter post, too. It's so childish and immature. I agree. I agree. I agree. When it's fine to send death threats to someone's family, it's completely not mock someone's dead brother. Because it's absolutely like disgusting. Them. Now we're gonna watch the second video of this. Because this was made the day after. It has been leaked. So I have been doxxed. My private information has been leaked online. Yay! Good job, internet. Good job, Twitter! Find my full name, where I live, pictures of my house, pictures of my dead brother's grave, and mocking my dead brother's grave on top of that. And then, on top of all of this, continuous amounts of death threats. Yay. This video is being used as a paper trail for I can okay. show to my lawyer, also the court system, because I am going to be filing a lawsuit against the individuals that are responsible for doxing my private information. Now, as you can see on screen, I already have a few people that, mm -hmm. you know, is Yeah, we looked at those earlier too. The same as going off to advertisers for content creator, it only fuels haters and fluffs up everything for everyone. Yep. No one should be proud of using Twitter, honestly. Yeah, I agree. I use Twitter because as a content creator, I gotta have the advertisement purposes of a Twitter to advertise my own account because a lot of people do use Twitter, you know? But some parts of Twitter, or rather most parts of Twitter, are just vile. Not necessarily going to be potentially in this lawsuit, but I do want to showcase the actions of what I've been going through throughout this entire ordeal in the last 48 hours or so, ever since the first episode of Dawn to Dawn came out, and I uploaded my video on it this past Wednesday. So Boy, yeah, Dawn to Dawn has said this and this. This entire situation made me more curious what the fuck this show is about. This show, from what I understand, is airing on Netflix, by the way. This show is airing on Netflix. So as you can see here, this is one individual partaking in the mockery of my brother's death. We have an individual that is hoping that I basically get uh, my brain stem stomped in and, <laughs> and my corpse Classic. is spit on. Makes sense. Yup. Beautiful. Mm. Tasteful. Twitter's fortune, but even more emotional. Definitely more emotional. They I think it's about to have a lot of likes. The post is still uh, up, by the way, not shit. been terminated or violated any 
Twitter uh, rules or anything like that. We have people making false thumbnail images of me trying. A person fabricated a... There... Bruh. Someone fabricated a thumbnail. Are you for fucking real? This is actually slander. Bro, this is slander. Yeah, sue them. Fuck them. Honestly, sue them. ...to slander me saying I made content like this and then trying to say, yeah, I made a video on this, when in reality, I did not. Then we have a post like this where someone put a petition out to stone me to death. A.K.A. there was thousands of people that liked this post. This was an early on screenshot. Sadly, I didn't get a... Doxing was so common in Germany that we have a law to not dox others. If you still do, you get two years in jail and you need to pay a fine. Really? I didn't even know. I should read up on our laws. I should read up on our laws, man. <laughs> Damn. Late stage screenshot, but the last time I saw also the post based of Germany, man. Got Fucking based German law. Got removed thanks to violations of Twitter's terms and service. It had 12,000 likes. AK 12,000 people were wishing for my death. And so we escalate all this that's been happening for the last few days to the point to where my private information has been doxxed. And now the threats or death threats that I have been receiving are all more real. Very, very much real when someone posts pictures of my house and my brother's grave. Yep, this is where we draw the line. Doxing. Death threats, it's ridiculous. The fucking Boruto community doing this, man. And I don't even wanna, like, I don't wanna pinpoint this on, like, a community. I heard that the Boruto community is really vile and disgusting, right? But at the same time, I don't wanna pinpoint it on a community for doing this. Because it's just people being disgusting. They are bad actors in all communities. You know, that's why I don't want to pinpoint this on a community. I want to pinpoint, like, I want to put this onto people. FYI, I don't like to talk about this much. I talked about it briefly a long time ago because Anime Snob, can't believe I mentioned that man's name again, he mocked my brother's death as well. They committed suicide. Lovely. And obviously, I'm assuming this individual is probably from that rabid group from a long time ago. I could be wrong. We'll find out when uh, the lawsuit gets underway. But the point of the matter is, is that um, I am a little bit concerned about my safety because of... Understandably so. I don't think it's a community per se. It's more just actions by unhinged individuals. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Obviously, my girlfriend lives with me. I have two dogs I love and a cat as well. Obviously, I'm concerned. I mean, yeah. definitely after having 10 I plus thousand so, people too. wishing for my death, and literally you can go into any of my recent tweets and Thanks look at the quote retweets and seeing people actively justifying death threats against me, it's very clear that I do have some cause for concern. So He does. He does. This is same as MH. MHA community is just more popular series, more people, more potential bad actors. Yep. 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 Well, thankfully, I live in Tennessee. I don't live in uh, California or anything. I'm able to oh. legally own a gun. I've owned this. <laughs> oh my. <laughs> what? <laughs> Wait. America! Hell yeah! For a while, and I'm gonna tell you right now, if anyone wants to pull any stupid games, you're gonna win stupid prizes. That's all I'm gonna say. What I will say now, going one step oh further, I'm gonna end this video here for legal reasons as well, but I am going to be protecting myself. I am definitely someone that will be watching, and if, you know... Now, I got the evidence, I got screenshots, those that, you know, are involved in this, you will definitely be hearing from my lawyer. I'll leave it at that. Once again, this is the end of it. Leaving this as a paper trail. She be out. She be out. Damn! America! USA! 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 Bro, just said pull up. <laughs> pull up then. That's fucked. But if it scares some potential stalkers, honestly, yeah, can't blame the guy.
I can't blame the guy for showing the gun. I can't. Honestly? In all honesty? If he's able to protect himself in that way, if others come and try to do harm to him... Go for it. It's his right. It's his goddamn given right in America to defend himself that way. Can't blame Chibi at all. Nope. Nope. Can't blame him. I don't blame him. <laughs> I don't blame him at all. Bro's getting death threats left and right. He's got a gun. He's not afraid to defend himself. Sure. That's... That is why we have it. Yeah. Yeah. I, I'm not gonna go into the gun shit of America because... Bro, that's a whole nother topic, but... It's his right. Um, there it is. It's his goddamn right. Ever around the fuck out, literally. This is literally it. He literally is saying, fuck around and find out. Chibi is in his right to defend him herself. Yeah. They have thrown him so many death threats on Twitter. That's insane. Yeah, it is. Don't you have it because government could go corrupt? I'm gonna leave this topic. Yeah, leave this topic, man. Leave it. Yeah, that that is that. That will do. That's all I have to say on this matter. And yeah. Thanks for watching.